The next place we visited in Provence was Arles. We found our hotel at Place Voltaire. The Hotel Le Belvedere was nice and decorated with a certain panache. After a day on the road, we were hungry and had to find some food. I couldn't translate this very quickly. I think I'll have better luck here. How do you say Guinness in French? Now, to do some exploring. I'll follow this street from the hotel. Wow, look at this. 2,000 years ago, this was major entertainment to the Romans. Think gladiator. All the games were free, of course, but the higher your social class, the better your seats. In medieval times, all those arches were bricked up, and there were 200 homes inside. It's been restored now, of course. Look at all those souvenir sellers on the right. Most of the souvenirs celebrate one of Arles' most famous residents, Vincent van Gogh, the artist. A lot of postcards have reproductions of his paintings on them, like this one of the cafe down the street, and this one of the drawbridge, and his chair. He even painted the interior of the hospital in which he was treated for his mental illness. And this is a self-portrait from late in his career. Once Paul Gauguin visited him for a while. Think about it, the dynamic duo of French painting right here in Arles. But they had a misunderstanding. Gauguin left for the South Seas and Van Gogh eventually killed himself. Hey, what's that on the wall? Hmm, it was last week. I missed it. Maybe the next time I'm in Arles. I think this street leads to Republic's Place de la République. That obelisk in the center is from Roman circus days. The church is St. Tropidine, named for a fourth century bishop. Claudette watches the children's play from the balcony or keeps tab on the French Communist Party. Great photo for the calendar. Market day in a French town is a big event. People from the surrounding areas come in to town to shop. The first Wednesday in Arles is a flea market with very few vegetables available. I bought this comic book. It's going to be a to translate. More clothes. And this looks like some interesting old tools. I don't know what they are. Hey, this looks like military stuff. Is that a Tommy gun? These look like new dresses. Wow, I really do like these African masks, but we've got to hit the road. Da -da.